Hey there dreamers, it's time to get your head out of the clouds. Welcome to Black Girl ASMR. So actually, I won't be doing any ASMR in this video for Black Girl ASMR, but my next video, there'll definitely be some. Uh, today, I just wanted to explain ASMR to normal people, to black people, but to people who don't necessarily listen to ASMR and are interested in finding out what it's about. But you know, targeting that audience, hey. Uh, I'm not gonna be doing it in a whispered tone because I know that some people are like, what is a whisper? why is she whispering? But let me explain why and then maybe you'll be into it. I will actually put a bunch of links in the description of a bunch of amazing ASMR by a bunch of different ASMR artists and all of their talentedness and just their magicalness, you know, dental whispering, ASMR darling, you know, all of my babies. Uh, but yeah, so you can check those out after I explain it to you if you're into it and you're down for it. Basically, what ASMR is by definition. ASMR, Autonomous Sensory Meridian Response is a term used for an experience characterized by a static-like or tingling sensation on the skin that typically begins on the scalp and moves down the back of the neck and upper spine. It is most commonly triggered by specific acoustic, visual, and digital media stimuli, and less commonly by intentional, attentional control. Some of the triggers for this may include listening to softly spoken or whispering voices, listening to quiet, repetitive sounds resulting from someone engaging in a mundane task such as turning the pages of a book, watching somebody attentively execute a mundane task such as preparing food, loud chewing, crunching, slurping, or biting foods, drinks, or gum. Basically, yeah, that's pretty much it. What is all that supposed to mean? Basically what it means is that there's these sounds that people can create, such as like tapping on stuff or whispering. That's why everybody's always whispering at the beginning of ASMR videos. If you tried to watch anybody else explain it and they started whispering from the beginning, you got freaked out. That's why, because that sound when they whisper from ear to ear, it's what causes like this tingling sensation. Personally, I don't get them in my head, I get them in my back, everybody's different, you know, you'll live your life, you'll figure it out. But that tingling sensation is really freaking dope and it helps people sleep. It helps people with insomnia, people who suffer from depression, people who suffer from anxiety and all those kind of things. It's just a really calming, nice sensation that'll help you sleep. And when you put headphones in, that's when you're really gonna experience the ASMR like effect, like the actual trigger, the, the buzzing, the tingling, the woo ah. But it's actually just really calming in general. You can listen to it while you're chilling, whatever. So a lot of people think it's like creepy or sexual. It can be used sexually. A lot of ASMRs are gonna get mad at me for saying that, but it can, get over it. Sexual ASMR does exist. Um, you just have to accept it for what it is and just know that there are certain ASMRs that just to help you sleep and there are certain ASMRs for you know, your private time. Some of my favorite ASMR sounds are pencil nomming, which kind of sounds like this. Hold on. I don't have an actual mic right now. I'm trying to explain it to you guys. So here, it's like, that sound, or I really like the sound of marshmallow eating. Me. But everybody's sound is different. Some people don't like mouth sounds because they don't like mouth sounds when people chew when they eat. So why would you like them when they're just like in your ear doing it? But you can find people who tap. You can find the sound of like inside water and people playing. There's a plethora of choices, people. You can just go through the internet and find whatever sound best suits your tingle needs. It'll be lit. Hey, you don't have to like it, just accept it for what it is and know that it does help people. That's the most important part, is just knowing that it might not be for you, but it is for other people, so just respect it and love it. And that's me explaining ASMR to people who don't listen to ASMR. You're welcome! So, now that you know what ASMR is, you know if you're interested, if you want help sleeping, or you just want to chill out, or really know what it is, you can go check out some of the links in the description. I put Gentle Whispering down there, Zeitgeist, ASMR Darling, and all of the people that I absolutely love. One of them, I can't pronounce her name, but it starts with a P. She's my favorite, so, you know, check her out. It'll be the top one, I promise. You know, me, hello, black girl ASMR, yeah, you should subscribe. And if you decide to subscribe, you know, wait for some more videos, check me out, I'll be doing all that whispery, tapping-y, cool -y stuff. That's pretty much it, you guys. I'm happy I got to explain it to you. Have a good night, dreamers. Go to sleep.